repeating each exercise between 10 and 20 times, starting with 20 bicep curls. Stand with the feet roughly shoulder width apart. We're going to curl the arms up to the shoulders, keeping the elbows in towards the waist. The only part of the body that should be moving is the lower arm. We want to engage through the stomach muscles and relax the shoulders. Keep it nice and smooth all the way up and all the way down. We want to create nice long lean muscles. So use the control. Breathe out on the way up, in on the way down. Halfway through. Keep it nice and controlled. There's no rush, the slower you go, the harder the exercise will be. Five left. Nearly there. Three. Two, engage the stomach. One, and relax. Roll the shoulders, shake the arms out. Bring into 10 tricep curls on each arm. Lift the arm up to the ceiling, bend it in behind the head. Want to try and keep the elbow as close to the head as you possibly can. Doing good. Engage through the stomach muscles and try not to raise the shoulders. Five left. Keep the knees released. Three. Two. And the last one. Good. Lower the arm, raise the other. Keep it as close to the head as you possibly can with the elbow. Really engage those stomach muscles. You don't want anything else moving other than that upper part of the arm. Doing really well. Extend all the way through the length of the arm. You've got five left. Four. Three. Two. And the last one. Good. Roll the shoulders, shake the arms out. Going into 10 bicep curls extending forward. Curl the arms into the shoulders, lift the elbows, extend away, bring it back into the shoulders, elbows down, release the arms. Have the hands facing towards each other and as you extend away you really want to pull the shoulder blades and lats down the spine. Really engage all the way through the middle. Support as much as you can so that there's no movement in the body. Doing really well. Make sure you release the knees so that you're not locking them out. And just keep the arms as extended as you possibly can going through the full movement of the arms. Doing well. Halfway through. Keep breathing. Keep supporting. Extending the arms away. Bring it back in. Release the elbows, release the arms. Good, three left. You're doing really well. Nearly there. Use the breath to help assist you. And the last one. Lifting the elbows, extending away, pulling back. Bring it back into the shoulders, elbows down and release. Roll the shoulders, shake the arms. Excellent. We're going into 10 lateral raises over the head. So again, find that nice stability through the body. You want to reach the arms away to the side, going all the way up to touch at the top. Keep the shoulders nice and relaxed. Engage the lats down the spine. Engage the stomach. Breathe out on the way up, in on the way back down. This will help keep you grounded. Doing really well. We're nearly there. Just keep breathing. Two left. And the last one. Good. Roll the shoulders, shake the arms out. Well done. Next exercise, we've got 10 pec decks. Raise the arms in front of you at 90 degree angle. You want to open from the chest and just keep that 90 degree angle throughout. Engage through the stomach and rotate from the shoulders, pulling down the spine at all times. Doing really well. Five, four, three, nearly there, two, and the last one. Good. Roll the shoulders, shake the arms out. Going into your pec pulses now. So come to a 90 degree in front of the chest and you just want to pulse up and down 20 times. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and relax. Roll the shoulders, shake the arms. Going one more time for the last exercise of the workout. 1, 2, 3, 4, doing really well. Just keep it pulsing and keep those elbows as close together as you can. Nearly there. Three, two, one, and relax. Roll the shoulders, shake the arms out. 
Well done. That's your arm workout complete. <laughs> <laughs>